There's a feature on the Tree Dazzler that's called Show, and what it does is it cycles through each color, kind of brings it up and down. And the reason I like this one is it reminds me of my grandpa's old aluminum tree that had the color wheel, and it would go through the seasons and change it from green to red to yellow. And this kind of has the same effect. I, I, I don't know, just presses my nostalgia button. Let me show you a few more cool things on this. One of the surprising things is we leave this on for months at a time. We just don't bother turning it off. And the thing is, is um, we're the, that person that goes at like a month after Christmas and leaves it up just because we like the glowing lights. But I've had this for years. I think I've had it five years now. We haven't had one bulb burn out. We haven't had one problem with it. It always works. So I really highly recommend this product. It makes our tree beautiful. And I've transferred it to multiple trees. It's really easy to put on. So I love it. One of the surprising features is you can use these outside. People have been buying them for weddings. So they use this for weddings and put on ambiance or in a garden. It's a kind of never even thought about using it outside of a Christmas tree. So you can get kind of year round use. One other feature it has is what's called still, where if you just want the lights to stay on, you can select a color and they just stay on. You also have this shimmer feature where they go in and out. That's one of the other buttons and you can cycle through. If you look at this, it tells you how many shimmers you have. You have five different ones you can go through. You can cycle through these. And this is the last one. This is called show. And show makes it like chase around itself. And this is the one we usually leave on, honestly. But what I really like the most is that our tree is about six feet high and it is a skinny tree. And it really, really does a great job. There's times where we just left the ornaments off because it fits skinny trees really good, but you can put it on a wide tree too. Now I'm showing you this kind of at the early daytime. So this is what it looks like 